we need to learn like technical side or we need to like learn how to use AI like uh, the tools uh, which we have right now. And... Uh, I think it's both. I think the more you understand what underlies these current tools, the more effective you are at taking advantage of them. But um, I think we'll be in this funny situation where people who don't know how to program, who use AI to scaffold their programming abilities, will become more effective developers of value than people who've been programming, you know, for, for a decade, right? So even if you're just a pure tool user, you're going to find that the gains to utilizing those tools are very, very high. But I think your ability to use those tools will continue to improve the more you understand the underlying uh, methods and mindsets of people developing machine learning systems. Uh, so I think it's I think it's both, and I think they're highly highly complementary. We need to learn like technical side, or we need to like learn how to use AI like uh, the tools uh, which we have right now. And... Uh, I think it's both. I think the more you understand what underlies these current tools, the more effective you are at taking advantage of them. But um, I think we'll be in this funny situation where. People who don't know how to program, who use AI to scaffold their programming abilities, will become more effective developers of value than people who've been programming, you know, for, for a decade, right? So even if you're just a pure tool user, you're going to find that the gains to utilizing those tools are very, very high. But I think your ability to use those tools will continue to improve the more you understand the underlying uh, methods and mindsets of people developing machine learning systems. Uh, so I think it's I think it's both, and I think they're highly highly complementary.